there, Psych2Goers. Welcome back to another video. Before we start, we want to give a big thank you for all the support you've given us. Psych2Go's mission is to make psychology and mental health awareness more accessible to everyone. So let's begin. Have you ever stopped to wonder if the things you're doing with your life are right for you? Is your life on the path you wanted to take? Even if you don't know where you want to go, or if life's difficulties are complicating things for you, you can still determine if you're going in the right direction because chances are, you still know where you don't want to go. With that said, here are nine warning signs you may be on the wrong path in life. One, your mindset is stuck in the past. Do you constantly think about the times you messed up or obsess over people who have wronged you or ruminated on old memories? Our mindsets are powerful things. If you have a tendency to view the world in a pessimistic way, or if you're constantly dwelling on negatives, it can keep you stuck in a place you don't wanna be. If you find yourself consumed with the past and barely living in the present, it might be because you're not heading where you're supposed to be heading. Two, things don't align or make sense. Do you always try your hardest, but don't feel good about the outcome? No matter how much you try, you just can't make things work. Does it always feel like something is missing or things just don't add up? Life throws curveballs all the time. However, if you're doing the same thing over and over again and expect a different result, maybe it's time to try something new to achieve the outcome that you want. Three, you aren't satisfied. Do you wake up and feel unmotivated to start your day? It isn't necessary to jump up with intense enthusiasm every single day, but you should wake up in the morning and feel at least some sense of satisfaction. Life satisfaction is important for our health and well being. If you can't even be excited about the day ahead, it's probably time to figure out how to change the life you're currently living. Four, you have no energy or enthusiasm. Are you tired no matter how much you sleep? Do you reach for coffee after coffee after coffee just to get through the day? Low energy could be a sign that you aren't enthusiastic about what you have to do every day, and it's making you mentally drained. American businessman Bo Bennett said, enthusiasm is excitement with inspiration, motivation, and a pinch of creativity. To be enthusiastic and therefore have enough energy, you need to be excited and inspired and motivated by your life. Five, making choices feels difficult. If you're lost, unsure of whether or not you're on the right track, you might find yourself always second guessing your choices. It could be because the options on the path in front of you seem equally terrible, since they don't reflect the life you wanna be leading. It could also be because you don't wanna think about the decisions you have to make, since that would involve facing the reality of the wrong path that you're on. Avoiding the hard parts of life might be better in the short term, but there will ultimately be a time you have to face them. Six, you're always stressed out. A study published in 2013 found that having a direction in life makes people recover more easily and more resilient in the face of stress. By startling people and measuring how quickly they compose themselves after, it concluded that higher levels of purpose in life predicted better recovery from a negative stimulus. Meaning, when we know where we wanna go, we're better equipped to face adversity. So if you're not recovering from your stress easily, it could mean that the life path you're on isn't one with purpose. Seven, you aren't focused. Are you overqualified for what you're doing? Do you find it hard to concentrate on what you're supposed to be doing? That's normal to some degree, but if you're constantly fighting with yourself to get your work done, it could be because the work you have to do has nothing to do with the work you truly want to be doing. Eight, you aren't confident. Many people struggle with confidence, particularly in terms of their physical appearances. That doesn't mean you're heading somewhere that's wrong for you. But if you aren't confident in the actual way you're living life, it's a sign you're on the wrong path. If your self-esteem has been dwindling, pay careful attention. And nine, a gut feeling. Is there a little voice in your ear telling you something is off? If nothing else, your intuition might be telling you that you need to make some changes. Intuition is simply non-conscious thinking where your brain works on autopilot and is actually a result of past experiences and all the knowledge you've built up throughout life. Is the reason something you can't quite put your finger on? Well, if your gut is telling you that things aren't right, you should listen. There's probably something about your current journey your brain knows that isn't reaching the surface. 
Finding out who we are and what we're meant to be doing is certainly not easy. It takes effort to get on the route that's right for you. And you might need to backtrack or start over a few times. But looking back, your future self will thank you for the effort you put in to start in the direction that was right for you. Do you relate to any of these signs? Do you think it's easier to change course rather than toil away on the wrong path? If you like this video and the way we explain the subject, subscribe to our channel. We try to explain complex subjects in simple language and cartoons to support students all around the world in their learning.